with your excellent innings, the big innings that you've been waiting for. How's the feel, feeling after you went into the 90s? Thank you. Yeah, I know. I've been, I've been out three times in the 90s in the last seven games. So it was a bit of a, I wasn't nervous, but I, I, I want to make sure I get a hundred. So I think that was good. And then scoring a big hundred was a good confidence and contributing to team success is always good. So after you in 96, I think Ron was saying something to you. Can you share what is that in between? Uh, no, he just told me get your hundred and then we can think about it because we had a very good partnership. So by that time he scored his 50 as well when I was on 98, 99. So. So he's just like, take your time, it's fine. You don't have to do it in like the next two, three balls. You know, you can just take your time and do it. And then once after 100, I, I made my mind clear that I'm going to go and maximize it as much as possible. So the last time you played here, you didn't have a good memory to end up with. Uh, what was the feeling when you went 24 for three? No, honestly, I think the last time we played, it, it was not the worst memory, trust me, because we scored 315 and we were struggling as a batting unit before that. So scoring 315 was actually a good good thing for us going into the competition in Namibia, you know. So I think it was actually a positive game for us. And of course, coming in today and winning the first game was a good feeling. So 180, uh, is this the best uh, ever you played in your career, the scoring-wise? Oh yes, by a long march. And I think 140 was the highest score for me in under-19 and this 189 was is the highest score I've ever scored, yeah. So you made the winning start. Uh, how do you see your games going forward? Of course, a good confidence boost for the batting unit. We've been consistently scoring 280s, 300s. So I think it's it's good that as a group we're very confident. And of course, I think we have a very good bowling unit. We all know that. So I think it's good confidence boost for us. And hopefully, we continue this the rest of the games. So the batting lineup that, that you experimented on in the last League Two series uh, looks a thing of a past. How you, how are you uh, coming up with the change in coaching as well as this batting lineup? It looks so strong. Yeah, no, I think we had this uh, uh, change in batting lineup in the, the series in Namibia where we had to win to qualify for the. For the World Cup qualifiers in Zimbabwe, and of course, you saw we performed really well there. And I think we have confidence, and even if one, two guys don't score, we always know there's batsmen behind us to score. I think that's great. Of course, the change in management is, of course, different, it's new. Uh, the boys are in a good space, so I think you'll see us perform well like this in the, in the future games. <laughs>